that's me. Now we're going to calculate the alpha values for H4Y versus PH. We start off with KA1 times KA2, which is equal to KA1 times KA2. You lock the cells by pressing F4 in the keyboard and press enter. You do the same thing for KA1 times KA2 times KA3. Again, you lock the cells, press enter. Again, KA1 times KA2 times KA3 times KA4. Press enter. pH can be any number. We are doing pH in the increment of 0 0.2. 0 0.2 0 0.4, 0 0.6. You highlight the cells, then you drag down until the pH of 14. H is equal to 10 to the power of minus pH. You press enter, then you double click. Now we're going to calculate the denominator for alpha 0, alpha 1, alpha 2, alpha 3, and alpha 4, which is equal to h to the power 4 plus h to the power 3 times k1 plus h power 2 times k1 k2 don't forget to lock the cells plus h times K1, K2, K3 plus K1, K2, K3, K4 Enter Double click Alpha 0 is calculated by h to the power of 4 divided by the denominator. Press enter, then double click. Alpha 1 is equal to h to the power 3 times k1 divided by the denominator. Press enter double click alpha 2 is equal to h to the power 2 times k1 k2 divided by the denominator press enter double click alpha 3 is calculated by H multiply by KA1, KA2, KA3 divided by the denominator. Press enter, then double click. Alpha 4 is equal to 
Ka1, Ka2, Ka3, Ka4 divided by the denominator. Press enter. Double click. Now we're going to plot alpha values against pH. So you highlight the pH. Pressing the control key, you highlight the alpha zero. You go insert, scatter, graph. Now you want to do the same for alpha one values. You right click, you press select data, then you go and add. Series one will be alpha one. X values would be pH. And the Y values will be alpha 1. You do the same for alpha 2. The series name will be alpha 2. X values will be pH. and the Y values will be alpha 2. Highlight the column, you press OK. Do the same for alpha 3. Series name will be alpha 3. X values will be pH. And Y values will be alpha 3 press OK. Last one will be alpha 4. You add series name will be alpha 4. X values will be pH. Y values will be alpha 4. Press OK then you press OK. Your graph should look like this. To move the graph, you right click, select move chart, into a new sheet, press OK. Now we would like to label the axis, but first we would like to format the axis. So format axis, you right click, press format axis, fixed until 14 press OK close then to format this axis you right click press format axis fixed until 1 also you want to change the number which is in scientific you press number and then you press close. To label the axis, you click on axis titles from the layout, primary horizontal axis title and title beautiful axis. You label the x axis pH, then you click on axis titles, vertical axis title rotated title, you label the Y axis alpha. Also you can name the chart title above chart. We're going to name it H for Y alpha values. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.